higher even. So this video will learn how to check if our input box is empty or not using JavaScript. So let's get started. Let's have basic HTML structure here. We'll link to a style sheet. Add this script file at the bottom, which is script.js. We need one div element here. One input element, one button. Let's make it check. We need one h1 element. Let's make it result. Now save it. Go to style sheet. Select body element. Text align will be center. Select input element and the button. Display will be line block. Padding will be 10 pixel and 20 pixel. Select div element. Display will be inline block for this. I'll just save it. Open this file in the browser. And this is the output. Let's try to understand how to actually work. When I will click this button check, I want to verify if it is empty or not, this text box. If it is empty, I want to show empty. If it is not empty, I want to show not empty. So let's go to JavaScript file. Let's select the button first. So it will be btn check. Select input element. Select h1 element. Let's make it result. Add event listener to the button, which is click. This is the handler function. Now, first of all, we need the value of the input element. So, create a variable value. This is a property value. And here, we'll make use of trim method to remove leading and trailing white spaces. Now simply we'll check the length of this value variable like this. If it is equal to zero, that means it is empty, otherwise not empty. Save it, go to browser. Now enter some random text here like this. Click on this check button so it is not empty. Remove it, click again, we are getting empty. So that's it. I hope you got the point how it actually works. See you in the next video. Have a nice day.